Let's start with our ongoing coverage of the worsening Seoul Tokyo trade dispute. The South Korean government is expected to give the green light to corresponding measures against Japan's export restrictions. It's considering whether to remove Japan from its own white list of 28 nations receiving expedited export reviews. And the trade ministry held a related ministers' meeting on this very topic. For more, we have our Hong Yu on the line for us. Any details coming through? ji as you mentioned, South Korea's Minister of Economy and Finance, Hong Nam-gi, convened the meeting to go over possible countermeasures to Japan's new export curbs. It's a closed-door gathering, and the results of the meeting will not be announced today. They haven't specified when the information will be made public yet. But according to the Trade Ministry, top officials are discussing whether to remove Japan from South Korea's so-called white list of preferential trading partners. They will decide on whether or not to change the import and export regulations Regulations for strategic materials headed to Japan. This means South Korea might take away Japan's benefit of having a simplified inspection process. Now, before this meeting, an interagency meeting on the state affairs was convened by Prime Minister Lee nak Did he mention the trade dispute there? Yes, Yoon. Prime Minister Lee described Japan's economic retaliation as unjustifiable and a move that should not be taken by a world-leading country. But he also emphasized that the Japanese government did not regulate exports other than the already regulated items that are the three core materials used in semiconductors and display. He noted that Japan has allowed one of the export-regulated materials, EUV photoresist, to, ex- to be exported to South Korea. He also emphasized that Seoul will up its diplomatic efforts to recover from Japan's export restrictions, Chiyun.